you pioneers happy tuesday it is the 26th of march as they see four just another crazy day at plank north we have a bus emergency drill your teachers will give you more info about that today and the book fair also begins today so have fun while you're down at the library gorgeous just gorgeous outside today what'd you say <laughs> all right you guys can please stop what you're doing stand direct your attention towards the flag we kick off our nice tuesday with the pledge i, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the united states of america and to the republic for which it stands one nation under god indivisible with liberty and justice for all and on top of that did you go to the pool yesterday yeah all right how was it it was fun water cold too bad. Not too bad. All right. And then you got one more day. You guys go again tomorrow? Yeah. And then the other half of the building is probably going to the pool for the first time today. All right. We got uh, a couple of birthdays. Happy birthday to Ben T and Mr. Jackson. All right. Happy birthday to those gentlemen on this date. What do you have? Happy birthday to Sandra Day O'Connor, who became the first woman U.S. Supreme Court justice in 1981. You know anything about the U.S. Supreme Court? It is like the highest court in the entire country. All right, very, very difficult to get up there. All right, and what do you got for a fun? Uh, what did the egg say to the other egg? What did the egg, like little eggy eggy, say yeah. to the other egg? Uh, you crack me up. Excellent. Excellent. Who is that from? Dean P. All right, thank you so much. We have, oh, first up, we have some Rabbit and Kangaroo Club members. First graders in the Rabbit Club, congrats to Luke E., William W., Ray L., H., Henry L., Hadi N., Cora C., Now Release O., Seppi S., Lilith M., Alana P., Allison A., Isaac V., Isabel G., first graders in the Rue, Hadi N., Now Release O., Mikey P., Henry L., Seppi S., Mailer G., Allison A., second grade Rues, congrats to Max R., Marat C., second grade Rabbits, Leo L., Max R., Bianca T., Maddie O., is there a backside? There is not. Congrats to all. We have three shout outs. First up to Lincoln K. Thank you so much for being a responsible substitute helper. It was great to hear how respectful you were to Ms. Conlin. You rock, honored by Ms. O'Hanlon. To Elise, Hall, Elise H. Ellie created a beautiful family tree display board. The display board was eye catching with its colors and leaf layout. Ellie showed very interesting stories about family members. Her grandmother published a book called Just One Soldier about Elise's great grandpa. That is really cool. Ellie's dad got to play the cello with you, Yo-Yo Ma. Lots and lots of stories with roster connections. Awesome work honored by Mrs. Murky. And another one going out to Jacob S. Jacob completed a biographical review for his project and researched the life of Arnold Schwarzenegger. I'll be back. Jacob shared interesting information about his early years in Austria leading to his bodybuilding, acting, and political careers. What an interesting life. Jacob, you're here. What it's state was other. he the governor of? I don't know. It's other Jacob. <laughs> Oh, Jacob's in me. California is the correct answer. Thank you, Jacob. All right, we have five golden coins. Would that be correct? Yeah. All right. Mrs. Mason hands the first two. Antonio M. Antonio consistently shows responsibility by tracking his lesson times and leaning when he needs to. He is mindful of time and his responsibilities. And to Maria C., Maria shows pride in her beliefs and commitment to excellence. And she chooses to fast during Ramadan. She's responsible for taking care of herself and is an inspiration to the other. Love that one. To Annabella S. from Mrs. Wiedeberg and Mrs. D., thank you for showing care by turning in a lost library book. You helped find the friend it belonged to. You are always thinking of others. You rock. And the next two are from Mrs. Gotti and the UPK team to Camelia F. Camelia is a positive leader by always following the group plan and being a great friend. And to Asher D., Asher does a great job of keeping the classroom clean and organized. And you, how are you doing today, Fitzy? Good. You doing all right? You ready to rock and roll? Long time pioneer. Favorite memory? Meeting teachers and making friends. All right, it is a nice one. Are you excited about middle school? Yeah. Because you're going to be able to do the same thing there. All right, what's a hobby you have? Or a hidden talent or a hobby? Um, I'm a good baker. You, what's your favorite thing to bake? Like your go-to? The yellow cake, yellow chocolate cake. Pasta. with chocolate sprinkles or no sprinkles? Sprinkles. Sprinkles. All right, that's a, a, impressive. When you're older, what would you like to do? In So the teeth, huh? All right, that's a very edible field to be getting into. Uh, something that makes you laugh. My cat Gus. All right, what does Gus do? Jump on the walls and do parkour. Wait, well, yeah, let's go backwards. You say he jumps on the walls. Well, he has parkour moments where he jumps off the couch. Yeah. And he flips. And he does like a flip. Yeah. 
Boy, if there's ab- acrobatics for cats, Gus sounds like the person for that one. All right, what's something that makes your family unique? We go skiing together. Cross country or downhill or both? Downhill. All right, how long have you been skiing? Since I was three. All right, how dif- I've never skied before. How difficult is it to stop? Not really difficult. Do you do the snow plow, or can you do it like on both both feet on the sides? I do the snow plow, but I'm learning both sides. All right, sounds like a, a magical yet there. All right, let's go through your favorites. All right, you pick which one you want to do first. I'll do favorite food. All right, what do you got? Taco. Taco, spicy or not spicy? Not spicy. Homemade or from a restaurant? Homemade. Homemade. All right, favorite animal? Um, baby monkeys. Baby monkeys. No baby monkeys at home. No. All right, favorite place you like to get away? The Florida Keys. Have you been there already? Yes. What do you love to do in the Keys? Uh, well, Other than the sunshine. We fed the fish, but I was too scared. You were too scared? Just my dad, dad did it. You did it? I it, watched because there were pelicans chasing me. <laughs> those are those big birds with the big beaks. If you have the opportunity to do it again, would you feed the fish? Maybe. Maybe. All right. If they were smaller. If they were smaller. And the pelicans weren't bothering them. All right. Yeah. Last but not least, favorite movie or TV show? Harry Potter. Which one? Or all the above? All right, well played with that. Thank you for joining us. Tomorrow we have Lily W in. And this is Murky's class. And this is Murky's class. Enjoy the sunshine. Please remember to show cooperation, accountability, respect. Excellent. Let's go.